almost all of your AirPod Pro's basic controls are based around the force sensor, a small touchpad built into the stem. We will be going over seven ways to utilize your AirPod Pros. To use the force sensor, you need to lightly squeeze the stem. Squeeze the stem once to play or pause whatever's currently playing. Also, if you're receiving a call, squeezing once will answer it. Squeeze the stem twice to skip forward to the next song. If the app you're using doesn't support this, squeezing twice won't do anything. And if you're receiving a call, squeezing twice will reject it and send the caller to voicemail. Squeeze the stem three times to skip backwards, either to the beginning of the current song or to the last one. If the app you're listening to doesn't support this, squeezing three times won't do anything. Another AirPods Pro signature feature is noise cancellation mode and transparency mode. Squeeze and hold the AirPods stem to switch between noise cancellation mode and transparency mode. You'll hear a light ding when the change goes through. You can also change between these features on the phone. Slide down the top right corner of your screen to access the control center. Press and hold the volume meter. Click on noise control and choose between noise cancellation, off, or transparency. You can wake Siri with your AirPods just by saying, hey Siri, out loud, followed by your request. Hey Siri, search Tech Insider on YouTube. Here are some videos of Tech Insider I found on the web. You can also set up Siri so it'll automatically read you any message you receive while you have your AirPods on. Open the Settings app, click Notifications, and then click Announce Notifications. Here you can adjust your announcement notifications. To activate the spatial audio features of your AirPods, slide down the top right corner of your screen to access your control center. Press and hold the volume meter. Click Spatialize Stereo. Here you can turn on fixed or head tracked spatial audio. Fixed makes the audio surround you, but it sounds the same any direction you look. Head tracked makes it so the sound will change if you move your head as if you were listening to a single speaker in front of you instead of headphones. You can also select off for a standard stereo sound. To customize your AirPods, open the settings app, then click Bluetooth, then click the eye next to your AirPods. Here's where you can change your AirPods name, adjust noise control, configure your press and hold options, run an ear tip fit test, and configure spatial audio. Charging your AirPod Pros is easy. Place them inside the charging case and connect it to a lightning cable connection or a QI certified wireless charging pad. When you start charging your AirPods, the case's LED lights will glow either orange, meaning it needs more charging, or green, meaning it's fully charged. You can check how much battery your AirPods and case have by opening the case near your iPhone or by using the battery widget Check out our video on how to enable the battery widget if you don't already have it. The link is in the description. Unlike other AirPod models, the AirPod Pros have plastic tips that are supposed to bend to the shape of your ears, but everyone has slightly different ears and the default tips won't always fit. That's why every new pair of AirPod Pros come with three sets of plastic ear tips, each one a different size. You can remove your AirPods current tips by pinching them firmly and pulling them off the earbuds. It takes some force, but don't worry, they'll pop off without issue. To attach new ear tips, line up the oval on the edge of the tip with the oval on the AirPod speaker. Then press the tip into place. If you're not sure what size ear tip to use, take the ear tip fit test. With your AirPods on and connected to your phone, open the settings app. Click Bluetooth, then click the eye next to your AirPods. Then click ear tip fit test you'll be led through a series of short exercises that test how well the AirPods fit in your ear. At the end of the test, it'll tell you if your current ear tips make a good seal or if you need a different size. <laughs>